Hello, Intellizon users. Jordan Malik, founder of Intellizon. One question I get is uh, from folks is, hey, Jordan, can I take the Intellizon software, download a list of ASINs, and upload them to Price Checker 2 for further analysis? The answer is yes. If you don't have Price Checker 2, uh, head over to jordanmalik.com slash price checker, and uh, you'll be able to get it there. So what Price Checker 2 does, it's an analysis tool. I think it's primarily probably used for folks who are private labeling or, whole, or excuse me, procuring private label products or wholesale products to give you some extra information. So when you take your downloaded file of CSVs, you can run it through Price Checker. Now you're going to have to follow the Price Checker instructions that they have on their site to be uh, to do this properly. You're going to have to put a, a couple settings in, um, you know, here. You're going to have to put your settings in there and then... Um, upload your file and select a few column headers. Uh, as is, when you upload the CSV file from Intellizon, it's going to include a lot of columns um, from the original file. So th this is going to look a little bit cumbersome to you, but see the all these links here is from the original file because I uploaded the, the whole file as is. You could essentially go into the Intellizon downloaded file and delete everything but the ASINs to be to kind of run it clean through Price Checker and get these results. So uh, the things that you'll be able to see with Price Checker 2 is the bestseller rank, right? Uh, the product group that it's in, these are things that Intellizon won't tell you. The buy box seller type, the lowest uh, um, merchant fulfilled price, the lowest FBA price, uh, new number of sellers, right? That's critical. The number of FBA sellers that are contending for the buy box, estimated sales per month, estimated share of sales per month, I'm not sure what that means, estimated buying cost per month. Uh, estimated profit per month, and that's calculated from somewhere. I'm not sure uh, how they got that amount, but I'm sure there's other tutorials in Price Checker 2 that will give you a better grasp of this. Uh, I'm not an expert in the, in this field. Um, uh, let's see, number of reviews, uh, average review score, uh, and some links here, the size tier, the, the uh, extra fees for weight dimensions. Um, order handling, let's see, pick and pack, 30-day storage fees, etc. So um, if you're uh, looking for the winners, if you're looking for further data to, to extract a winner from into the uh, downloaded file of all uh, the seller storefronts products, you can use Price Checker 2 to further analyze that. Good luck.